Okay, so the Tillson 225 is on Lonnie's cart or my cart, whoever ends up with it. So this is a 24 millimeter air filter adapter. Nobody for, cares. <laughs> for a 24 millimeter Makuni, you slide this on, set the Allen screws, and it'll hold a standard like stage one go power force air filter. So what we gonna do is we're gonna drill a hole right there and tap it for a eighth inch MPT barb, and we're gonna put like a little eighth inch barb in this. Because, and some people say this don't work. Why would you do that? Why would you do that, Greg? Uh, well, we got these Six Sigma nitrous kits. Everybody's gonna be like, that's CO2, that don't work. Uh, these are used in, um, not this, but this is used on whip it, like whipped cream makers for like people that own restaurants and stuff. I thought that was CO2. No, it's uh, nitrous for some reason. They use it for cooking stuff. So you just slide that down in there, screw that in, it'll pop it. And then when you hit that button, it gives you a spray of nitrous. Uh, so you would basically, we're gonna make her, uh, Becca's old engine, run a little rich. So when we do hit the nitrous, it'll do the right. You know, and it'll just be a little sneaky shot. So anytime we have a pit, Lonnie can swap out the NOS. And then uh, when he hits it, it'll, like a screen will pop up and say, danger to manifold, and the floor panel will fall out. So we have a uh, set. What? What about when we run out? What's going to happen? <laughs> we'll just run rich. Uh, so we got seven bottles of nitrous. Uh, shout out to Six Sigma. They was the second sponsor we ever got on our channel. Go Power Sports was the first. And then I used this nitrous kit and I said, hey, your boy wants some more nitrous. So they sent us a ton and they sent us all these jets. So on an upcoming video, we're going to see how much nitrous a stock 212 Predator can handle. We're going to try to run it purely off nitrous. like. So if you don't hit the nitrous, it's going to run too rich. So we're going to hook up multiple bottles, multiple jets. They sent us bigger jets for the, this is actually a jet on the end of this. So, you know, is it cheating? Sure. But it isn't going to be like a crazy amount of power. It ain't like Lonnie's going to. It's not a 300 shot. Yeah, it's like a one shot. So it's probably less than that. I should know. You shouldn't have said that. Uh, so we're going to drill a hole tap it we're probably gonna have to notch our air filter to go around it you know and watch out for the hose clamp so i'm gonna try to do it right in this ridge and that should be fine enough to get the hose clamp on maybe now we'll see we'll see all right i'm gonna try to you want some more of it i try to oh my gosh that goes straight through it might be plastic. I, I think it is plastic i thought it was aluminum but it's all that down up no nah, that's plastic fur tree that just eight straight through Oh, good, good bit. Ah! We need safeties. <laughs> that hit me like in the temple. That ah. was close to being an eye shot. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Dang, that bit's The little one can't take it in. <laughs> you say the little one can't take it in? Yeah, off of a uh, gold member. Well, I don't watch dumb movies. I'm a grown you man. You love gold member like every other American. I do! What are you doing, Terry? What are you doing, Terry? So a 10 millimeter 12 point fits this tap. Ooh, three eighths fits it perfect. Dang. Dang, cuz. Now you know stuff. That's brazy. Do the little rainbow. The more you know. <laughs> the more you know. Since it's plastic, couldn't you just like thread the bolt into it and that would- A bolt? Probably, the barb. Yeah, cause it's just gonna thread it because it's plastic. I don't know. That must be like titanium plastic because your drill bits were struggling. No, it's those drill bits <laughs> was $100 for that can of drill bits. They're good bits, they just don't have the Flat locky spots. thingy. It's the stupidest thing I've ever done did sink. Look at that though, you can see threads. Okay. Can you see them? So, you can't. Yeah, there that is. What? Now, next step. Look at all the wall art. It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. All right. So it looks like we're running a quarter inch barb with a eighth inch NPT national pipe thread. Um, we're going to Teflon it. <laughs> Good gosh, it's like Nats just Hey, you know what's nice about this garage? What? The fact that it's 3,000 degrees in here. <laughs> Hey, not for long though, I got that DIY Mr. Cool kit coming. Three ton unit. I've been hearing house. that for three weeks, I'm sweating. I know I am too, that's why I gotta wear this do-rag. Listen, 
Not, not the game. Not Greg. It's All right, man, Dan. Yeah. Sorry. Come on, man. The, the dude we saw earlier, the white guy, That's a that was do rag. I wish we could share the things we see around Sweetwater, town. around our little town. Oh, well, Greg, why don't you just jam it in there and it'll fight itself? Yeah, it looks like it's working great. Yeah. It's got Teflon tape now. You're, the metal's not touching it directly to cut. There is no reason to yell at me. Hey! <laughs> Oh jeez. Okay. It's a good thing the echoes broke down. You know what's broke down? Your marriage. <laughs> good <laughs> gosh, man. <laughs> oh yeah. I'm telling Peyton you said. Don't. That. She's a sweetheart. Don't do it. It'll break her heart. You got that sink in there. It's, it's not. Oh yeah. It's gonna put a nice notch or spray. I mean, like I said, it ain't like this stuff is going to win a race. But it's going to be fun. It's cool. All right, so now. <laughs> we, we hit it and it's... <laughs> 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 hey, we won. Get three laps ahead right off the bat. No, we save it for the final lap. We're in dead yeah. last. And around the last turn, we pass everybody. All right, so now nitrous barbie pull that old air filter off these got little set screws around them cool part go power sports i think that's pretty sweet little air filter adapters it would be awesome if i like made your youtube channel go under i'm doing that myself <laughs> <laughs> it's so true this <laughs> <laughs> is our last try at fame I'm on the cars and cameras. <laughs> uh, it up. works by a negative way. Like you start getting views and everything from his fans coming over, but they just rag on you the whole time. <laughs> You're like, well, I'm making money. Yeah, I've got a lot of subscribers, but they all hate me. Every one of them just trash talk me to death. All right. All right. So what I'm gonna do? You gotta gonna measure. Oh, I ain't measuring. Just measure. That works great. It really did. I seen it. Where are we going now? Look at the two seater fully independent suspension buggy we're working on. Well, Greg's working on. <laughs> I've done absolutely nothing. I would love to be here to help, but you don't do it on the weekends. We do dumb stuff like this. Oh! Whoa! So we gotta keep this hidden. So I'm like, dude, no freaking notches, dude. I'm like, Papa don't play no games. You should have it pointing straight down then. You can twist the adapter. You can shut up. Twist the adapter to where it's pointing straight I've down. I've already tightened the Allens down. Oh yeah. We, we had to switch complete engines after completely thinking that the other one was gonna work and doing work. I think it's it. fine, they'll never know. They'll never know, they're just like, hey look, there's a barb for no reason. Yeah, they won't look it over. We're hoping. We hope not. We need the shortest run <laughs> as possible. So, because the shorter the run- Don't the, look at the camera. <laughs> the harder the hit. <laughs> uh, so, I'm thinking, you reach back and hit it. No, no, no. <laughs> Ooh, 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 ooh. You wrap the cord around the frame three times. I'll wrap it around your neck. Okay. Hi. So I do have, where is it? Where'd it go? I have a um, gas valve for a welder. So what we could do is hook up a small 12 volt battery, put this gas valve there with the bottle right off of it. So it's just like a run, like tuck it under the head so it's all hidden. Yeah. And then we could basically have, have a, a run that long and have a button, an yeah. actual electric button. Hot dog, that's what we're doing. Where's my valve at? We're wasting a lot of time on, on something nitrous. that's gonna happen for, for seconds. three seconds. I think the bottle will last with the oh jet that's in it eight seconds. Oh, goodness. That's pretty awesome, too. Oh, that's really awesome back there. Oh, the old John Deere. John Deere. 
So this is a mountain bike um, little air compressor. So you can use this with CO2 and air up your bike tires. This will thread directly onto the valve stem and you hit it and you can air it up with CO2. So all Six Sigma's done is basically gave, made some jets, like 40,000s, 50,000s, 60,000s, stuff like that to let the precise amount of NOS out. So basically we have that jet here, but if we was to just pressurize this, we can pressurize the crap out of it it blows his hose off. But if we pressurize it, that means this is getting a full open shot of nitrous to the engine, like no control. So what we've done was taken a 40,000th jet. Can you sunk that with your eyeballs? It's in there. And then we've clamped it. So this will go onto the air filter thing that we just tapped, the little uh, air filter adapter. So it only lets 40,000th of nitrous through. To test this on this uh, welding solenoid, we can and it pressurizes it you feel it yeah it like gets that hose tight so if you'll listen you'll hear this valve right here blow a bunch of gas out let's clamp that like that so that means if lonnie has this we can't just at first i was like oh we could just zip tie this down so it's no, because thousand psi. Wow, yeah, it'll go. Those to little bitty <laughs> bottles hold a thousand psi. So that's uh, not dangerous, but dangerous at the same time. So what we're gonna do is run this up. Our problem was with this nitrous kit was a five foot hose of line took too. You know what I mean? It, you lost a lot of your pressure by sending it through five foot of hose. So now, what we can do is run three or four foot of hose up to Lonnie, and he can have this in his seat. And to hide it, we'll just tuck it. We'll cut a slit in the seat to slide it in. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. So you pull it out before a race. You go ahead and pre-charge it, you know, to the safe limit of... Which we've we've felt it. It's probably, what, five or six pushes? Oh, my gosh. It, it swells up big time. Like right now, I push Five or six? Probably four or five, yeah. But so then I just you push hear it about five or six. It's pre-pressurized, so yeah. it shouldn't sense the whole shot into the engine i mean but lonnie can just uh pressurize that thing and just hold her down you know until it runs out of the go go juice that's what i would say to do. that's what i'm gonna do yeah and it would be best on like coming out of the corner yep. hit it and uh takeoffs and stuff i would imagine so this is sick because now we can mount this gas regulator and this is just a welder a mig welder gas regulator we put two barbs in it ran this to some quarter inch holes and that was a mother shoving in there that little jet so now we have a 40 thousandths if we need bigger we can drill it up so and then this just runs to this we can mount this hide it somewhere on the engine probably on the back side of the engine run this small hose over to our air filter and then this will go i wouldn't use that red hose though that's going to stick out pretty pretty bad yeah we'll use some black just yeah. uh you know hose which is probably stronger than this stuff anyways and we'll use good hose clamps we'll tighten the far l of it because this stuff starts to swell big time so so all this all said and done i can't remember how much these nitrous kits we've literally had these for four years uh and we just forgot we don't didn't forget we have them we just forgot we had them uh so this hose setup for the hose the little regulator you're looking at 20 bucks and then you buy the nitrous kit which i think is like 30 bucks so it's scary we blew the hose off a few times One more but without the clamps there are hose clamps now so that's gonna work it's pretty sick so we wasted a good hour uh, more than that on r d on the nitrous it took us almost an hour to get that uh 40 i'd say about 000. 25 minutes felt like a long you. time but okay uh so now we got our nitrous kit ready we can go get it all installed on the car then we're going to put a red button on the steering wheel bright red button nothing it's a kill switch button Lonnie hits that puppy it'll open up nitrous so Lonnie will pre-charge his nitrous we'll hide this so you just reach in you know where the button is you give it a couple of squirty boys and then uh <laughs> you have the button on the steering wheel that you know go baby go what if it just changed the game just, oh! <laughs> okay we're idiots so let's get this put on so go power sports has these four by 110 wheel hubs but these 4x110 wheels do not fit them. So using a unibit, just step them up to the next pass. And this is the only, uh, the only wheels we have is these. This wheel looks like it has the same offset. So 
Uh, I just hope we can clear it. That's the only thing. Oh! Yeah. This uh, steering is horrible, too. You can only steer it when you're moving, pretty much. But looks like we got good clearance. I mean, I'm sure when the suspension flex and you got her turned, it's probably gonna hit body panels, but we could take off this plastic and that would give us a lot of clearance, but if we run into that problem there, we'll do it there, so. Not yet. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So. It's in its natural environment. Oh, we God. Be quiet and sneak We've got to get low. It's and a long way to walk like <laughs> <laughs> So, as you guys seen, we put nitrous on it. So if you peel back the duct tape, there's my little... The nitrous tank is in there. So what Lonnie has to do is prime the line. Because if you just open the bottle, it'll blow the hose you off. You die. <laughs> so in this little compartment back here is a 12 volt um, Milwaukee battery. So that is ran to this toggle switch here. If you listen... You listen to that solenoid. So what Lonnie will do is prime the nitrous system, about five squirty boys, and then <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna change the thing out. Then yeah, we have to change the tank. But then he just hits that button and it opens up the valve. And inside this line right here is a jet that controls how much nitrous goes into the motor to blow it up really quick. <laughs> so for efficient motor blowing up. <laughs> we did not jet up the carb, so it hopefully it runs rich from the factory. Probably it don't. don't. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna get lead thrown into my back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. Let's do a hunk of steel in our back. <laughs> so we did upgrade the wheels and tires as Jimmy and Braxton do with some Go Power Sports. Oh, that made a huge difference on handling. I'm mm. sure. Mm -hmm. Like didn't handle before, now handles. Nern, nern steering. <laughs> nern steering. So he has a ratchet strap holding the bottom seat down, <laughs> uh, and we duct tape one bolts in this on this side, and then we duct taped it around. Uh, kill switch works though, correct? Correct. All right, so we're so saving So I won't that. die this time. Almost died last time. Yeah. On the test run. Next time on Redbeard's Garage.